Hey everybody, Steven here, back playing Satisfactory, and this makes part 9 of my playthrough here. I did a little bit of work since the last video, and with that last video, um, one of the big things was actually getting it set up to have the tubes, uh, the, the the transportation tubes, what would that be? Hyper tubes. So I got that set up, so we did a bunch of the different tier upgrades. And since then, did a little bit of work. I expanded this platform. I started to make that up there. I started. I actually created another uh, power, full power plant there, just to make sure that I had enough electricity. And did a couple just like reorganization things. Um, so really, the purpose with this is now I'm going to move the space elevator. <clears throat> So my whole thing is kind of a mess, and it's now at the point of, like, I need to start restructuring things and cleaning things up. So I want to move this. I also want to move the HUD. Is it called the HUD? The hub. Um, the HUD is what's around me, right? <laughs> but I do want to move all of this stuff over here. That way I can really clean this up. So one of the first things is... I actually want to move the space elevator over here. I just have a more open area. And uh, hopefully I can feed in more things to that. So I'm going to move that that direction. But in order to get it there, I actually want to have the platforms for it. And I don't have any concrete. Luckily, this thing is full up over here. And then I'll actually fix this up later. So let's get this going. <coughs> So I'm going to kind of get this rolling on my own and then we'll jump ahead when I'm a little bit further. All right, so I'm making a little bit headway. Got this all covered. That's covered. Uh, certain areas like here with the grass, I'm going to actually have to make these platforms raised up with this if I want it to look more like it's concrete and not going through the grass. Uh, I'll do that later. Um, it's looking crazy where it's turning into like a concrete jungle, right? Um, but yeah, you can see it here where I'm having to raise it up so that it isn't just like the concrete and a bunch of grass showing through it. And I already have that in certain areas, but I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to have that and how that structure is going to look. Part of what I'm going to have to do here. So hopefully with this, I can get this flattened out over here. And in terms of like, where is this going to go? Um, not a hundred percent sure. I was kind of envisioning envisioning right here, but uh, I don't know. I may end up right over here, somewhere. The harder part is I need enough space so that I can get all the different uh, stuff going to it without it being a huge issue to even get that set up. So. We're going to keep plugging along here and see where we get. All right, let's at least get this out of the way because I, I don't have it. Whoa. There it goes. It's like, why is that taking forever? I didn't think I finished this out, actually. So I don't have the space kind of how I want it. We have all of it. Yeah, I think, I think we have all of it. But it's a start, so I'm actually thinking maybe it sits with this larger platform area anyways. We'll, we'll see here in a second. I mean, this is a decent size. Oops. So, I mean, I might go here. I don't know if it'll let me on this portion, but let's grab that copper wire. Yeah, that might be my only bet for right now, just to have it here, not... Not that it's functional. I don't, I don't think this is very functional, but at the moment I just need this out of the way. Let's see what that does. Uh, 
Uh, not a fan. But it'll be all the way for now. So we can get some other stuff done. Like I said, I'm not making any of that stuff just yet. Hopefully, but with this cleared out space, hopefully I can actually start getting some of this other stuff rolling. I'm gonna do this tube again, just because it's fun. That's so cool. <laughs> there it is. I'm just now realizing too, I deconstructed that and it, I didn't have the space for the copper wire. That's why I didn't have it on me. All right, so how do we want to do this? Let's get some of the stuff made. I need an assembler. Out of reinforced plating. Oh, and I forgot I did find sulfur, and that unlocks some research stuff. But I'm thinking once I get that, I don't know if that leads to that. I know you eventually get a gas mask. That may be the higher tier five and six. All right, let's take those. Then let's go. Right now, put you right there. Same thing, I think this stuff's gonna change because right now I'm just trying to get this stuff rolling. I know I want another one over here for this steel stuff. And this will change once I kind of figure out the flow of how I'm gonna get this stuff done. Let's see, we need that. Smart plating can go to the other one. Automated wire. Industrial parts, that and that. Modular frame, it's that and that. Oh man. So I need a hundred of the automated wiring, 500 of the versatile framework, and then I need, is it five? Holy smokes. That's going to take me a while. Although I already have most of this, that shouldn't be that bad. I'm actually going to go, let's get that started. I don't worry about the other stuff. One thing at a time. All right. Reinforced plating, there it comes. And I can actually drop off some of that right now. There we go. All right, let's get that going. Yeah. What's the other big one? Reinforced plates and that. And the reinforced uh, iron plate. That's the one I need the most of. Similar we can do. I can get this probably done. Just drop some stuff off in it. Uh, I don't know how I want to do that actually. Piping and that. I got a ton of the piping right now. I need to get rid of some of it. Uh, let's move this. This is a horrible way to set this up. I'm going to just do it for now. Just trying to get this stuff done. And then, literally, I'm going to start to organize this kind of on my own. And somebody made a comment about it, like it being rough. And, and actually, that's... That's the fun part, like, I don't do it on these videos, but that's the one of the fun parts I like doing. Um, just because it's very tedious, and it looks really cool when it's done. Let's 
Go there. Boom. Now let's feed in this. And we are in business. There we go. And so it'll go the stator. And then after that, I'll use that for the automated wiring. I'll need that. Okay. So I got two of them kind of rolling. Oh wow, that just takes a long 30 seconds to make. Holy smokes. It's gonna be a minute. Let me double check. Boom, boom. Man, I have enough to make this. Let's get this done. Yeah, let's get the MK3 done. I want to say I need the piping and concrete. Boom, boom. And power just went out. What happened? I seriously not have enough power. What is going on? enough coal I just don't know maybe it's a water issue capacity 280 that capacity was yeah going on here. Water is a problem. That water is fine. I have three. Uh, let's see. So I don't think that's actually going to work. I think I just need another water pump. I've heard two different things. I've heard you can have eight power plants and then I've heard three in terms of the water production. I have four and it's going out because there's not enough water getting to that other one. So let's try this, see what it does. Oh, bro. Where are you going now? Didn't think so, dude. No, 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 where are you going? I told you. Get out of here. You too. In my way. Alright. Water extractor. Right there. Alright, now. Okay. Pipeline. Boom. Right to there. Now let's merge this together. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That didn't work. There we go. Alright, so it's not looking like it's going to. I don't think it can pump like that. So it looks like we're going to just run another line and stack it. Yeah, because look at that. And we're dry. So now there's... Alright. We, we got work to do. Let's see here. I don't have the stackable until this is done. Okay. Well. I'm going to go get a bunch of the copper sheets and we're going to get this fixed up. 
All right, let's get this fixed up. We're gonna run these in parallel. Ish. Um, just because I don't have the ability to stack them just yet. That'll be the next tier, I believe. What are what I'll try to do? Oh yeah, you can't build on top of it. All right, uh, so let's get these done then. Not completely parallel, but not too shabby. I mean, compared to some other builds, I'm sure it's it's horrible, but for right now. All right, there it is. Finally, because if it's all running well, I have 355 megawatt capacity here. All right, let's turn this stuff on now. I can replace that with MK2 also, which I did for, I forgot I did that for the iron going for the coal to make the steel, which sped everything up because it'll slow me down. So I can start replacing some of these with this as well. But for right now, let's get the smelter going. Missing parts, man. I'm missing the very thing I'm trying to increase production on. All right, so I've cleaned up some stuff. I had a bunch of, I mean, just like my concrete was going all the way over here, just traveling a further distance. So I've packed it in a little bit closer right now. Still a ton of cleaning up to do. I did put this here so we can get copper going quicker, obviously, but get these production lines ramping up. Now I have this here, which I'm thinking I'm going to branch off and try and get some more iron going to that which means I need to fix this so let's do the splitter but I want it going is that the only way to do that? it would be this way so if that's an alignment, I want it to go like that. All right. Tweak that, tweak that, that and that. All right. Oops. Let's get MK2 going. What are you doing? That'll go to that one. This. Go to that one. And this. Wrap around. Now we can put that over here. I think I'm going to leave it where it is for now, but I'll, I'll eventually fix that, most likely. So let's go... we need a smelter. I'm going to say... Let's go in alignment with that, I guess. Alright. Here, to there, there, all the way to there. Not enough. Whoa, what is that doing? Let's try that again. All right, there we go. Okay, now.
iron and bada boom. Don't need that. What are all these ones? Don't need the track guys. Alright, we're good right there. Alright, so now we got that fixed up. Smooth that a little bit. And what do I need made? That is a good question. Right now, I guess I'll just go. I need iron rod for that. Fix that eventually too. So let's check how we're doing on all this stuff. Still low on that. Forty one out of five hundred. We got a minute. Let's see if I can do that MK three one. And we'll end this video with that, if I can. That's something I can realistically do. Yes. Yeah, because I was talking about that earlier, and I already forgot. Alright, we gotta drop some stuff off. I'm gonna get rid of that and that. I don't need just 10 plating. I don't need the beacons. Sulfur. Alright, I think we're good. Let's go grab some of this concrete. some of the steel beams there's my walkway to get up uh, one thing I did do is I created the little jelly deal so I have this just just jump down I just wanted to try it out and mess with it right but I think that's so cool <laughs> that it does that and then it was just like a fall straight into the jelly bloop it's crazy how that works and then we're through Took me a minute to realize how to get out too, because I was trying to jump out of it. I didn't know what to do. All right, uh, steel beams. What's going on here? Oh, did I? Now it's turned on. All right, we got that rolling already. Oh, whoop! Glad I checked that. All right. Let's see how this is doing. Yeah, full up. Which I haven't looked at these because the hope is to actually potentially run some of this up there. That may be a pipe dream, and this ends up just being, like, I don't know, a base or something up there that I can just chill in, but we'll see about that. And there we go. Boom. Stackable pipeline, that's the one thing I was needing, right? Logistics can be improved with a larger storage container and enhanced conveyor belt efficiency. Oh, I'm gonna get a bunch of that rolling. 
Let's do it. Yeah, buddy. Oh yeah, I forgot you can change the direction too and slow down and go reverse. There we go. Right where I needed to. <laughs> Alright, let's take all those. Do I have enough? Let's see what's going on here. Coal is my problem. We'll tell you what. Good spot to try this out. Place this whole belt. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, let's get some, dude. Because you guys are a pain to deal with. And so the interesting thing is seeing when it's like. Like, that's a huge difference. I also like, one of the things I notice is that the border gets higher and higher the faster it gets. So that's gonna be three. Let's, let's do that. And there it is. Get this really rolling now. see it that's what's up look at that holy smokes hold on here we go let's go for a ride oh, I thought it'd be faster when you hopped on than that now running on it's crazy See how this does. There it is. Yeah, now we're solid. Okay. Much better. Alright, I think that's going to be it for this video. So, move the space elevator. I'm not sold on that spot, but I also know it's going to take me a couple hours to fill that out the way I want it to be. And then, I, I'm still struggling with looking at the logistics of where my base is and how I'm going to do this. Honestly, the space elevator might end up right here in the middle, because that is a big open area. Um, so, looking at that potential. Uh, and then, once I have that little kind of lined out, then the tubes are going to be more important with how I'm actually traveling around this base don't know what i'm doing up here but i do need to fix up the logistics of this also which will be something i'll i'll do on my own just to get it cleaned up a little bit and then every now and then obviously like in this video you'll see parts of it but larger chunks are going to be on my own and i just had the power tripped all right well i gotta figure this out now too so that is going to be it for this video if you like the video hit the like button for me if you want to continue to follow along with all my content hit the subscribe button for me Thanks so much for watching.